Here at the Tower of London, Haida Liang is scanning an ancient mural. Until recently, taking a sample would have been the only way to examine its composition. But now, a repurposed technology is being used to peer inside the paint. It's a technique that was borrowed from um, medical imaging. It was first developed to look at um, uh, 3D in vivo imaging of the eye. We, uh, in 2004, started using this on um, paintings. Um, but we've never really scanned a wall painting before. The technique is useful since it uses infrared light, which can penetrate the layers of paint. It produces high-resolution images of what's below the surface. You're seeing through uh, the paint layer and getting cross-sections as you scan along. So you're seeing into the paintings that give you microstructures um, within uh, the paint layers. The images reveal the thickness and structure of the paint. But another instrument can determine what materials were used. It was developed by Liang and her team and scans a mural at different wavelengths of light. Each different kind of pigment will give you a, um, a signature reflectance spectra. And from that, you can t you, you can, you'll be able to tell what kind of pigments is used. And we can also probe into the near-infrared, where a lot of the paint layers becomes transparent. So you can reveal uh, the preparatory drawing um, that, that, that might have been done. So far, the analysis has revealed detaching paint from an area retouched during a conservation effort. Based on this scan, it also seems like the artist didn't draw an initial sketch. This information should be useful for art historians. We're interested really in finding out as much as possible of the history of the wall painting. It also means what materials were used, what techniques were applied, and also we're, we're interested to see how it's changed over time as well.